Okay, so the drone is only there to help you drop the fishing lure further than you could have normally cast it. Now there is already a product that is very similar and it's called Fleefly. It costs around $190 on Amazon and while it looks great, I prefer to make my own. And it will only cost me around $30. So first we need a wireless remote control and a receiver. I found this one for $4. It works with a 12 volt power supply and when I tested it, it had a range of about 200 meters. This is a very simple device and once you press the button on the remote, a relay or a switch closes in the receiver. So next we need a mechanical movement to actually drop the lure at sea. For this we will use a micro servo. This one cost only $3.59. To control this servo, we will need a microcontroller who can produce a PWM signal, which is what the servo expects to receive as a command to move its arm. For that I bought an Arduino Nano for only $4.2. This is a small and easy developer board which you can connect to your PC via USB, write some code, download it to the Arduino and then it can just operate as a standalone unit. And for power supply I chose a LiPo battery with 11.1 volts to power the receiver and the Arduino that cost only $6 and for the servo another LiPo battery with a 3.7 volts cost only $3. Now the way to connect all these components is quite simple. The receiver, once it gets the signal from the remote, closes the switch, that gives the Arduino a 5 volt signal to the D2 leg. The Arduino then sends a signal to the servo through the D9 leg to move the arm 180 degrees. Once the button on the remote is released, the D2 leg will go back to zero due to the pull down resistor and then send a signal to the servo to get back to the previous position. Now this is how I install it on my drone. So here on the right you can see the Arduino, it's on a breadboard. Uh, down here between the two legs I have the servo which is uh, mounted on a mesh, on a metal mesh. Here on the left is the remote control receiver, the white coil is the antenna. two batteries. You can see that I distributed the weight uh, throughout the drone to make it more stable. 